Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play some more New World. So we're continuing on here today. So we're just heading up here. Uh, we're going to something with the second or they say second gem or last gem. I don't know how that is going. I guess because already one of them were already in their play. I don't know. I'm not quite sure how that gem thing works, to be honest. But we're doing something related with that, plus uh, one more for the clothing, I believe. We're heading really close to the border. I think that's pretty much it for this zone soon. At least from what I can see quest-wise. Do, 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 do. I'm confused. Oh, what the hell? He's really in the ground there. Oh, it was just a two? A three or I don't know. It's a little easier. There you go. There you go. Nice, restored. Uh-oh. These are a puzzle, darn it. Suck up puzzles. Well, that one's and easier. They shall revel in their false victories, deluding themselves when the true test is still to come. She gets annoyed, doesn't she? Don't know if you'll aggro me. I think we're fine. You can only have five different types of trophies in each house. You own total of uh, 15 in total if you own three houses. But as far as I know, you can't have them all active at once. There we go. Did you manage to restore the last verdant gemstone? Strange. I thought I would sense something, but it's very faint. Hmm. Could it be because I'm still just an apprentice? I have much to learn. Yes, you do. Corinth is doing better than before. There is order and calm in the streets with Sotvik as the new speaker of the winds. And he's moved quickly to resume the tribute to Medea. So it should already be on its way. We should head back there. You definitely should. But now that we've restored the third gemstone, I'm going to visit the Druidic Warren of Thornhall. I'm hoping by some miracle my fellow druids are restored as well. I'll see you in town after. There you go. Okay. We squeeze her butt there, yeah. Oh, my thanks. How utterly divine. Look at this cloth. It has withstood the centuries and yet looks freshly made. Oh, if only I knew the secrets of those ancient thighs. Such vibrant colors. They're even more impressive up close. Do you need thighs? Oh, you are a dear. Uh, but not yet. First, I need to get these to the people of Corinth. Once the settlement is reclothed, then perhaps I'll have time to pursue my studies in uh, ancient days. Okay. And then we're going up here. Thank the stars you've returned. If the final gemstone has been restored, then that should mean we will soon have reprieve from the famine. I fear that hunger is quickly eroding the townspeople's patience with the new speaker. Unfortunately, there are new developments that may plunge us back into chaos just as we were starting to have hope. 
Just minutes ago, Captain Leovex sent word that a tribute encountered trouble on the road. Was uh, Leovex escorting it? Sadly, no. He's overwhelmed with the duties of town guard captain, so he sent some of his new recruits. Captain Leovex should be down at the gate. Please find out if anything can be done. Okay. Well, let's do that. We're supposed to have smooth sailing here, you know? We're, we're done this zone. That's what I thought we were doing here. And then you guys screw it all up. Oh, tip meter? It might be too li late for the tip. Did I get it? No, it was too late. It's the interface glitches up. Sometimes it won't pop up. Like, technically, I could have, should have been able to tip. It's just there's a bug, obviously, so. Good thing you're here, comrades. You won't believe it. But my recruits just returned with confirmation that the new tribute has come under attack. I was about to go myself. But if you're willing, I'd prefer it were you. Of course, just tell me where to go. The caravan came under attack at the Bullrush Wash River crossing. I'm told it's a full onslaught of lost. Recover what you can, including the speaker's letter to Medea. I'll prepare a new wagon. Strength be with you. Okay, so we're gonna go all the way up here, it looks like. A heck of a little run. We still also have the exclamation, exclamation. Well, this thing, yeah, we haven't really been up here, so I guess it makes sense we're going up here finally. I thought maybe it was just like an empty field, to be fair, so. I guess not quite empty as I thought, huh? Do, 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 do. So we're going up here and then left. Certainly understand your displeasure with the town of Gordon. But I hope you will accept my apology and remove the remnant to honor our government. The former Speaker of the Winds led Gordon with a forked tongue. He had forgotten our promise and the stories of how you have repaired personal betrayals in the past. For that very reason, he has been removed from office, and I have been sworn in as the new speaker. It is my solemn hope to resume the good relations our settlement once enjoyed with you. In this card, you will find tribute in double the usual quantities, as recompense for late delivery. I hope you will please reconsider any actions you have taken against our town as punishment for our failure. I know that with your guidance, we can return stronger and more fruitful than ever. Your humble servant, Sathvik Agarwal, Speaker of the Winds. Cool. 
Okay. Every time I have to see the terrible fate that's befallen my fellow druids, I shudder at the horror. <sighs> After all our work restoring the verdant gemstones, this is enough to make even me lose hope. Cool. This would suggest the famine was Medea's doing all along. But she's only resorted to such cruelty because of the verdant gemstones. Oh, Moira mentioned something about Medea's involvement in building the shrines. Um, so she's mad about tribute and the shrines? Yes. And now she's the one preventing the land from healing. There is a fourth verdant gemstone within Thornhall, you see? Ugh. She has taken the warren for herself and removed the gemstone to ensure the curse cannot be lifted. I'll have to convince her. She may not listen to reason, but she must be confronted. My powers pale compared to hers, so I'd be of little help. But if anyone can defeat a powerful sorceress like Medea, it will be you. My last hope goes with you. Okay. So let's go do that. What the hell is that thing? Oh, bison. We have a quest here we'll grab. It's all been for nothing. All my training. My research into the Iron Rose. There's no chance of me becoming one of the ranks now. Uh, wh what's gone wrong? I wrote an application letter and took it to Captain Silva. But he's head of the town's guard now. He doesn't want anything to do with the Iron Rose. Uh, there must be other survivors. I heard the rumor of a man wandering out east wearing their colors, but... Who knows where he is or if he'll listen. It's time I faced reality and sought a real trade. I could become a baker, I suppose. Pies are delicious. I'll find him and give you a, uh, give me your letter. I doubt he's even alive anymore. Likely he's lost like the others. But if you want to try, I won't stop you. Here, take it. Okay. That was oh, it was so beautiful for their second in the sky, and then it went meh. Look cooler for a second there. Okay, so we're going over here, but I want to grab this quest over here, obviously. That's showing up now. There she is. I guess you're gonna be uh, at night time in the darkness. Big open fields, way Eternum to go. Eternum is a new land full of strange beasts. New paths that need charting. There is so little we understand. Like the buffalo. They just don't make any sense. There must be an answer to the question of them. Cool. The buffalo? They are a species from a completely different part of the world from all others on Eternum. There must be a reason. If you head out to the west of Windsward, you will find a herd of them. Collect what you can and bring it back. I'll you have my gratitude. It's unlikely that they fell here out of the sky. I'm sure they are just as confused as I am about the old ordeal. Yeah. That sounds good. And uh, I guess we're going everywhere, but we'll grab this first, I guess. I guess we'll go backwards for the other one. I'm so confused now. What am I doing here? You are
are beyond brave to challenge Medea. Her power is truly stunning. How the hell do I defeat somebody? What? I'm supposed to defeat somebody, but there's nobody around here. Oh, Medea, she's over here. She spawns over here. Ah, uh, thank you. Uh, she is rare. Thank you. The markers usually show, but for some reason it didn't here. Oh, and there's the stone. Cool. That's why I love this game. You can ask with your voice, don't have to type it out. People will notice and stuff like that, so. to forgive me i've just spoken with the sorceress medea herself I i'm at a loss for words <laughs> i still can't believe that you defeated her that this is happening what did she say she said that you've proven the people here are worthy and that she allowed you to restore the final verdant gemstone i think she wishes to speak with you now i need to find somewhere to sit down <laughs> Okay. Okay. Wait, is that it then? I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's all. Because you have to remember that, um... I'm gonna ask these guys. I talked to some other guy. He thinks it's the old guy after this, so. We'll go over here and we'll see what happens. Okay. Well, here's a buffalo. Uh, that must not be the buffalo then. <laughs> I just like how long that, that slice timer on uh, these guys are. Oof. Full 30 hide, yeah. Hmm. This is the one I can know. That's the one I can't. Darkness, death, a baleful curse. Darkness, death, a baleful curse. That's all that is left of our order. Company of lies and ashes is more like it. I dreamt of defending the countryside with my comrades in arms. But they've all fallen now. Uh, Valor is uh, a beacon. Those words? That's our creed. How do you know those words? Uh, you're not alone. I have a letter from a uh, would-be recruit. An application to join the Order. She's been training, and she speaks with discipline. There may be hope for the Iron Rose yet. I will take her on as my page, teach her our ways. Thank you, my friend. No problem. Thank you. Well, oh, this one isn't all available either. What's this over here? It's a bit weirder when you have a note like that in the public like that, but I'll take it. You want my bison? No? Okay. I was like more than happy to share it to be fair. Okay, we're gonna go up here. I'm supposed to gather some samples over here apparently. I can't believe we're approaching 40, damn. There you go. 
So it's journals we're grabbing. Oh, was that what we also grabbed before? Now it makes sense why it was in the middle of nowhere. I just love like how he shot back there for a second. He's like, oh, that's over the line, I think. Isn't that cheating? <laughs> it's so dark here, but it's bright enough. I don't have any filter on my monitor. I did originally here and there for night nest nighttime, but meh. See, I almost need like a nighttime change, like let us change it slightly at night to bright brighten it, but not the other way. My other monitor was like this is like a I IPS or whatever they call it, and it's a very quality monitor. That's only 1080p. I'm not rich like that, you know for like big 4k thing but um anyways it looks really good like way better than what i had before but the the i guess the the issue here in a sense it's not really an issue is that at night it gets darker in games like very dark okay i guess we're running back now Ooh, itchy arm. Oh, yeah. Those circles are so weird. This place is full of these, I noticed. They're all over the place, by the way. This is, I think, where you'd farm a lot of these. Did I really reach the max? I always reach... These are always max now. These used to not. Now, you can use it in crafting, too, right? For just to get that those extra whatever. Boom. Okay. We're going over here. Oh. I was going the wrong thing here. Oh, here's another one. Is this one big one? I think so. That's just one really big one. There you go. What have you uncovered about our furry friends? The spheres seem to be involved. Hmm, interesting. I left to chat with Elric. I believe he has been researching those. There is so much to uncover about this strange and bounteous land. It's mysteries and trance me. Entrance me. Awesome accent. Okay, I think that's it for that. And then we have the fishing stuff up here, and then some hand ins obviously there. Uh, let's go and switch to the other town, I guess, to hand in that fishing one potentially, wherever the hell that was supposed to be. Yeah, fast travel there. And then. Um, yeah, I need to do that one. We could probably do that next episode for fun, maybe. We'll see how I feel. It would just be a quick episode, potentially. What the fudge, Sickle? What is going on here? Were there lights in here before? Well, this is her thing. I just don't remember noticing all the lights here. Want to hit her again for fun? I think I actually hit her. No? I just noticed the uh, lights here. I didn't notice these before, so. Cool. I'm just curious. Okay. Let's get out of here. For fishing person here, I think. If you skip zones, it's like twenty. I guess every zone, maybe every zone distance, is another ten, maybe or something. I'm pretty sure back when I did these originally, they were like, "Hey, go from point A to point B." That's like fifty plus or something like that. 
and I don't feel like I got them as much either. So I, they, they definitely changed all that quite a bit from when I played. It's all good though. They've done a good job. They don't drown. It is a lake, I think. Oh, it's shallow. You got these fish yourself? Shields was right to send you in my direction to continue your training. Oh no. I've got so much to teach you. Let's do it. Hi there. I'm Master Fisher Ruby. Are you new to fishing? Uh, yes. Master Fisher Shields sent me to you. In freshwater, the more common baits you can acquire are snails, and in ocean water, clams. Oh. My colleague in First Light, Master Fisher Clemenson, would greatly appreciate this ocean water bait being delivered to her. Why am I fishing for Master Fisher? Don't tell her I said this, but she's got some trouble getting <laughs> Thanks. Hi there. I'm Master F in front. Don't tell her I said this, but she's been having some trouble getting bites lately. <laughs> okay, so apparently that's actually taking me elsewhere. Don't ask me where, though. Uh, catch snail. Oh, catch a snail in fresh water. I don't understand how you do that. Catch a snail in fresh water. How do you... Is it like, can you loot a bait? I don't know why I just did that accidentally, but this does seem weird. Uh, new world, how to catch a snail. Oh, you have to do it till you catch one. Okay. Pretty sure I saw a fish fin thing there, so that's definitely not gonna be a snail, but there's a 21 pound trout in this tiny ass lake. The actual hell. Apparently, Firefly bait will help you get a boost on this. I don't know how people know this. But that's this stuff here if we grab a bunch of it. Um, how do I get rid of this? There we go. No, I'm trying to get the... No. I'm trying to get everything... There you go. I think these had the Firefly bait before. I thought I saw some before. No, not fresh water. Oh, there you go. Okay, let me do this for a bit. There you go. We got 60 bait now, so. I'm just going to literally fish for a while. I guess you guys can sit here for a few of them, but maybe a couple of them. I won't do even a few, but then we'll head to. Uh, I'll just cut it, and then hopefully I can find some in the ocean, I guess, possibly. It's like I can't see it being a snail, because snails should be very 
easy to loot, to be fair. Small dragonfish, what the hell? Sounds special, to be fair. Like, if this was a snout, I'd believe it more, because it's a lot easier. Aquatic snail. There you go. Oh, I have to salvage it, though. Interesting. Okay, let's get out of here then. Why why do we have to salvage it, I wonder? So where is this aquatic snail? Here it is. Oh. I see, so we salvage this. Oh. And it gives a chance. Oh, I see. So that's how you do it. Okay. Let me fish a bit here and then we'll go to salt water. Okay, we're back. I'm on this coast here. I'm not sure how this water will be, but this is the ocean anyways, right? So I don't know if there's any special fishing spots or anything up here, but uh, I'm just down here. You remember we came over here originally? I just thought this might be a nice, peaceful place to fish. No one else is going to ever come here, right? So I don't know if there's actually fishing spots over here. I think you have to, there's probably a map online. Them, but I thought I'd just check myself, you know. But, uh, yeah. I think this will be good enough. So let's go ahead and hit F3. And then we're gonna do the bait again. Oh, wait, no, we're before we do that, we're gonna go in here because I did get a few more of those guys. There you go. Snail bait, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, no, it's this one. Sorry. Salvage. C. There you go. So, control C, I'm guessing? Yeah. There you go. Oh, it does all of them, too. Awesome. Okay, so we do the F3, R, and then salt water. There you go. And then, yeah, we can just go and... There you go. It's a peaceful place. Their sound effects are amazing, but I feel like I should hear more ocean sound effects where I am right now. That's a bloody clam. One shot. I can tell that looks like a clam. The water's so clear here, so yeah. There you go. Well, that worked out way too easily. Um, I put too much effort coming here, to be fair. Salvage. There you go. There you go. So that's it for that. Okay, that, well, at least we know how that works. I might do a bit more here while I'm here. Okay, so we're back in Monarch Bluffs right now. Uh, so Monarch Bluffs down here at the ocean. And our hand end is actually over here, so that's what we're doing right now. Are these just bushes? I think so, yeah. Did Ruby put you up to this? I don't know why she thinks I need to help. Don't get too cocky just because you got some bait. Yeah. Hello there. I am Master Fisher Clemenson. I can teach you much. What can you teach me? Here's a lesson. Have you ever seen a spot in the water that looks like it would be prime for fishing? These are called hot spots. Mm. Try your luck in these hot spots and then take this. Hmm. It's a message from me to Master Fisher Warwick. It is imperative that you do not open this note. <laughs> okay. So, catch a fish from active hotspot. Okay, so I think I have one in close by because I did get a map and looked it up and I didn't know that was coming, but I wanted to, I was interested to in see where hot spots were. And there's one just down this beach here apparently, so just right around here, I think.
I don't have any ocean bait, but I don't think that's a big deal. Look at all the fish stuff we've caught. That's cool. Oh, I thought I'd get you before you did that. Okay. You do have a treasure chest I like. Anyways, yeah, this hot spot I think is around here somewhere. What the? What? Oh, interesting. My numb lot, my auto run is broken right now. Let's try it again. Yeah, no, my run, my uh, numb lock ain't working right now. Weird. This game has these weird like interface glitch things, like that kind of stuff that would happen, and I don't know, it just happens. It worked before, and now it doesn't work. You know, it's funny. This is an active hotspot, so can hotspots break? I wonder, yeah. This is definitely not a hotspot right now, so let me keep looking, I guess, around. It's a rock, buddy. Oh, you guys get it all muddy already. Alright, well, here's our. Uh... And you can see. Pretty sure that was flowing all year, so. All right, so just kind of thought that was a pretty cool spot. You know, this could be like a little shallow well reservoir type thing. If uh, that wall was built up a little more and we dug out of there, if actually maybe shovels or something, but. And since holidays are coming up, it's super rare that I mentioned my merch, but I do actually have that. Like and we added a lot of different artwork this year. So like, here's this cool Zuzu Trooper shirt. Oh baby. I have these uh, track sections again. These are off the PL12 autograph and I also have Okay, I'm trying over here because this is where we're handing it anyways and the fishing hole well, was there obviously so I wonder if it's over here there's a fishing hole. What the hell? There doesn't seem to be any fishing hole here. Okay, there was a fisherman guy there, and I talked to him, and he was awesome. So, apparently, the reason we're not seeing any of them is because these are all two-star rare ones. The only ones we can see is the one-star ones right now, which is literally why we've been having all these issues. So, herp derp. We know where there's some one-star, because we literally discovered them and watched people fishing at them. So, I'm just going to run there now. Actually, we've done, uh, we saw the two-star over here as well, but I guess it's like... Certain ones, I guess you can see. I don't know what the, the rhyme and reasoning is, but we, we know that we can see these, so that's all that counts right now. 
We just need to catch three fish in an active spot. So this is seawater, unfortunately. So that's the only downside to this. We don't bait for this, but. Okay. So might as well not even bother putting bait there because we don't have any. Oh. That should be good enough. It takes longer for it to happen. I, and I guess maybe fish are smaller. Or I don't know all the rhyme and, you know, but either way. Bait's better. There you go. It didn't work though. I don't know if it's because it wasn't an active hot spot. Let's try again, shall we? So you don't see other people's hooks. Yeah, I guess not to be distracting and everything. Yeah, I don't. Okay, I'll keep figuring this out. So it's only active if fish are jumping in and out. Apparently fish aren't jumping in and out right now. So it's not active. It's just whatever the hell that is. So that's a bit weird. You actually have to have fish in the small circle jumping and splashing fish. The actual target circle may not be where it appeared on your screen when you slowly cast the circle. Maybe a green message on your bobber landed in hot spot. Okay, so that changed everything. Fishing is more complicated than I thought. So we're going to try over here. This is a hot spot of two. Why? We're doing so fine. My numb lock works, by the way. Oh, I think we already discussed that. All these cuts here, and my mind's, you know. I was hoping I could go here, but I don't know if I can. Okay, that's active. I think we're supposed to go on the land instead, but we'll try to jump up here and see if we can pass this far. You gotta be kidding me, they just unactive themselves? I don't understand how this shit works if the fish just unactivates themselves. You saw them, right? Like, there was active fish there. Uh, I think the server is just dying. What the fudge now? I can't cast. Let's try getting back up here if it'll let me. There you go. Oh, now it works. Yeah, not saying active uh, thing. It would say it, so. Okay, well that's silly. Let me keep Looking? Okay, they're jumping right there. See that? Better not scam me this time. He disappeared. Wait, no, maybe they're good. No, I think they just... They're gone. Okay, this is pissing me off. Oh, they're working now. I just waited a while. Apparently, they, they're not active or something, and then you have to do it, you know. Let's go back more. That was not my plan. Oh my goodness. There you go. There we go. This is painful, but I, at least I understand. Apparently he's exhausted, as in everyone already 
harvest everything out of it, I guess. I'm a little annoyed that it's not synced correctly, so you have to get up, like, right onto it, basically, before it shows that there is no fish in it. Yay, there you go. 25 pound salmon. Not bad. There you go. Okay. Okay, we got all that done. A note from Master Fisher Clemenson. Please put it down right there. No, my hands are too dirty to touch it right now, but thank you. But well, I want to know what it says. Greetings. I am Master Fisher Warwick. What have you got there? I have something for you. Now, the best training is hard focused doing. You've fished up some bait and a few meager samplings of fish, but I want you to fully commit to catching 15 fish. What should I do with these fish? Master Fisher Perchel can be distracted easily and forgets to eat. Take your fish to her and she will be grateful. Okay, I'm not going to do that with you guys. I will literally just go catch 15 fish and I'll be back. Okay, we finished that. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, I guess that's it. What's that? Oh, uh, fish food rations. I'm a bit peckish. Okay. She only talked a bit about it. Eh, that's weird. Oh, did I tell you about the one that got away? Wow, they really didn't want to do this. I swear that fishing fish was bigger than some of the wrecks you'll find around here. Wouldn't have been useful for alchemy too. How do you fish an alchemy mix? The bait, of course. Uh, that's so weird. What's your biggest catch so far? Catch eight fish longer than 20 inches and bring them to Master Fisher Park up in uh, Brightwood. She's a fisherman and alchemist, and she's been experimenting with new bait types. New bait types? Yes! She's researching what bait can reel in the longest fish. So remember to tell her uh, what you used. So weird. Okay, catch eight fish length greater than that. Okay, we're going to leave it there. This is a very long episode. I'm going to do probably the expedition off camera. I haven't decided, but um, we're so close to leveling, which is the darn thing here. Do we have any hand-ins? We have little hand-ins. Hmm. Maybe we can find out. You know what? Let's go to this town. I'm going to go to this town. I just want to trigger this level up, basically. I don't know if it's enough to level up, but we'll see. It's so close to leveling up here, so. And there's some notes in towns, right? So that might help too. That way we're level 40, and I just think 40 is a big number, and I just hate to get that off camera. I'll be caught chopping a tree or something stupid, right? So if we can get it together right now, that would be even better. Do, 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 do. Such a quiet place here. Oh, it's just a regular house, so we want to look for note cards or whatever around. Do, 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 if we can. I thought going to the town might be a lot of EXP, but I guess not. Not yet, anyways. I hope they didn't clear out all the note cards out of places like this. Darn it. This doesn't make uh, leveling easier, that's for sure. Oh, here you go. Oh, no, that's supply stuff. I guess they don't want me to level. Okay, there's always an inn. The inn might have something. Let's see here. Inn, where's the inn? That's over here. Let me check this one out. No. Crazy, huh? Usually these have notes around here and there. But I think they might have pruned them. Maybe put them more towards... I don't know if they rewrote some of them or not, but it's crazy. And this is the end over here? I can't tell. Oh, this... Did we just go to this one? I don't know. There's no notes around here. 
Let me go hand in some quests then, or oh, board stuff. Okay, here's this board. These have like no EXP, right? So, actually, that was a lot more EXP than I thought it would give me, actually. So, that's cool. Oh, we already have that. So, that might not be so bad as I thought here. Monarch Bluffs, is that the one I had? No, this is Monarch Bluffs, so that's not the one I have all the stuff at, but let's go here now. Lily Acid sits. Is she like a lily that's f acid? Wouldn't the lily wither and acid away? Here's this board. How much EXP? Very little. Oh, <laughs> you suck. Okay, I know how to get the rest here. Actually, let's see if there's... Oh, wait, what? There's another one there? I would not Oops. have believed it if it had not happened so soon after your departure. That's weird. We have new cause for hope in you, my friends. And I am now... I'm not sure where the other one was hidden there, but there you go. Progress, making the name for myself. Oh, there you go. Level 40. Sweet. Welcome to Territorialist Shore Great Clay. Okay. So there we have it. That made me happy. Okay, so we're going to end it here. That was a long episode, but uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. Let's put this stuff in here quickly. We'll sign you. Let's do the map stuff. Uh, let's put you into storage and you into standing game, I guess. There you go. Thank you, my friends. Have a wonderful uh, day, and we'll see you next time. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like. Bye.